and their manager, Barry Wheeler. Guys, you're on your comeback tour, and you're playing a lot of your classic material, but you've also got a new single out, right? How'd that come about? Was it hard to go back into the studio after such a long time? Are you kidding me? They were chomping at the bit. They were just the man has encountered this before. People whose integrity has been suborned by the insidious touch of the darkness. He has experienced it himself, but merciful light burned away the darkness oh. in his brain. Not good. The car seemed to sail through the crisp mountain air in slow motion, spinning around one axis almost lazily. The moment was hypnotic. Then it struck the pipeline in a shower of sparks, the impact turning the windshield into a burst of safety glass. As it hit the ground, I snapped out of my reverie. The car was rolling downhill, slowing down as every bump killed momentum but still coming. The fence wouldn't be enough to stop it. Oh look, Mr. Hero's here! You ready to save the day?
It's been two years since I came here. Being that long without Alice breaks my heart, and I know it broke hers. I know she thinks I'm dead. How could I blame her for that? It would be a crime to pretend that she owes me anything. She took all the stupid, self-indulgent bullshit I brought into her life and still stood by me. Still loved me. It's no betrayal. But I'm a better person now than I used to be. I want to be that person with her. You are gonna shit yourself when you realize what I've done. Shut up! Alice, my wife, the best thing that ever happened to me. She smiles and the darkness lifts. For her, I've tried things I otherwise never would. I've never really minded if it's made me feel like a fool. She's a photographer, and the world she sees through her lenses is unique and beautiful. She has the vision. She sees things others don't and knows how to make them visible to everybody. She did it with me, too. She teased out things I was only vaguely aware of. She always saw me in the best possible light. Okay, I should be able to figure this out.
have no idea how badly you're screwed. It's gonna be a blast to watch you find out. Don't wanna get hit by those. It's not... it's you. Did... did you help me? Looks like you're feeling better now. Yes, I am. Thank you so much. I don't know what happened. There was... this guy. Before you say anything, I know I look like him, but I'm not. Don't worry. You just don't feel anything like he does. He was in my head. I feel like I need to take 50 showers. Where is he? That asshole wanted to get into the projector booth. He was talking about fixing things so the sun never comes up. God, it didn't seem that weird when he was saying it. It sounded really good at the time. You weren't yourself. The projector booth. That sounds about right. I need to get in there. I have the access code for the door. Here. Thanks. I'm just glad you showed up now. He said he'd be back after he'd arranged for some security. Do you feel up to telling me what's going on here? We have an art exhibition here, supposed to open tomorrow. I'm the curator. My name's Serena Valdivia. Alan Wake. Holy shit, it is you. I didn't... I mean, I've seen you on the big screen. I... I know your wife. You know Alice? Wait. Big screen? Yeah, we have a film from her here. What the hell happened to you? Getting back to Alice. Oh, God, yeah, sorry. Uh... It's quite a coincidence that you're here. She made this short film. I mean, she shot it years ago. You're in it. It's a part of the exhibition. I'm in a film? Yeah, it's like... I mean, it's just footage she shot of you at some point. But she turned it into this... thing. It's, a uh, Almost like a memorial of sorts. Because, you know, you're supposed to be dead. Or... something. Uh-huh. How's Alice? Is she alright? She's... okay, I guess, all things considered. 
I know her pretty well. You're really Alan? I can't believe you're here. Nobody knows what happened to you. But there are people who say they've seen you. That wasn't me. It just looks the same. Like, you know. Yeah, but that guy's a lot more slimy. The thought of him makes me... I hate him, but I... There's something about him, this... God, he's so creepy. Anyway, you're not like him. At all. I hope you can stop him. System? I guess it was too much to hope for an alarm and a fat rent account. The Champion of Light can feel the fragment of the signal in his pocket, the weapon that can change what will be. It's incomplete, but it's all he has. Something, haven't you? Too bad it's not gonna do any good. I'm a better you than you ever will be, and I've got all the time in the world. Everything you've got's going to be mine. Your life. Your wife! <laughs> what are you gonna do about it? The sun's never coming up now. I can keep this up forever. Show yourself! is unstoppable. Time itself twists and tears, sweeping the champion of light back with its dark currents. Again he enters the world, but now he sees the trap for what it is, a maze that loops back into itself. 
I'm... I'm here again. They sent me back. In Bright Falls, I was constantly under attack by birds that were more shadow than flesh and feathers. But this is an evolution. Some of the Taken were actually capable of turning into a flock of birds to escape my attacks and turning back into human form to make surprise attacks. I'm trapped in the darkness. He has started appearing to me. Mr. Sk he can travel back into the world effortlessly, and he loves to rub my face in it. At first, he was just an echo in the darkness, a flicker beyond the edge of my vision. Now he started showing himself, getting bolder all the time, telling me what a great time he's having in the world while I'm stuck here, and what he plans to do, especially to Alice. All the moves I have left are dangerous and desperate. I have no choice. I have to hunt him. I don't make friends easily. I know plenty of people, but I don't let most of them close. I've known Barry Wheeler ever since we were little boys. We had the time of our lives. I'd get us in trouble, and he'd talk us out of it. Things haven't changed that much now that we're grown-ups. He's the most loyal and dependable person I've ever met, and all the things that count anyway. You could call him a weasel, and you wouldn't be entirely wrong. You could call him a clown, and I would reluctantly agree, but he has never let me down. Emma? You here? Night Springs doesn't exist. It's a fictional town from the TV show I used to work on. It was any place USA, a place we used as a backdrop for whatever strange story we had that week. One of the stories I wrote for the show involved a man, the champion of light, fighting his evil double, the herald of darkness. 
It was something I'd written back in the real world, something I had a link to, a framework I could build on. I had adapted it into a new story. This story. Okay. So this chick just came up to me and said she's my biggest fan. I know. They all say that, right? And she's giving me the eye. So I make a couple of moves. We have a couple of drinks. And then things start happening. But I say I have to go to the bathroom first. Uh-oh, right? She's got no idea. Watch this. This is going to be priceless. Mmm, mm, that's nice. I thought you'd like that. Are you tense? You feel a little tense. Maybe a little. I had a crappy day. Yeah? Don't worry. It's improving real fast. Yeah. Hey, don't stop. It's just getting good. Watch this. Wow, it is you. I, I guess all of it really happened. You remember me? Kind of. I felt weird all day, like I could almost remember a dream I had. And then, just before sunset, I remembered the page. Yeah. I'm going to have to go get those things again. Not all of them. I... I went out and got them. Well, most of them. I felt stupid at first, but then it was getting dark, and those... those things started showing up, and one of them made off with the battery. It ran into the railroad tunnel. There was no way I was gonna follow him in there. Sorry. It's good you didn't. You should be careful. I mean, really careful. Yeah, I, I kinda remember something. Something bad happened to me, didn't it? Forget it. It doesn't have to happen again, okay? Just do what I say. Yeah, okay. God, this is too weird. Am I going crazy here? Just go get that battery. Try to stay 